record that. There we go. Okay, so today's workout, we're going to do uh, four exercises at a time. And sorry, y'all. There we go. We're going to do four exercises, repeat them three times, and then move on to the next set of exercises. Our first four exercises, we're going to do a cross jack with an overhead press. So our feet crisscross and open up like a jumping jack. And then we're going to do a squat with a twist. So your hands go down, reach towards the floor, and then rotate. Bring the hands back together, stand up, switch sides. So squat with a twist. Then we're going to do a lunge. A lunge back. So we take our left leg, reach back, do a lunge. Bring the knee up, switch, step back, and lunge to the other side. So you bring the knee up high and do a hopping switch. And then we're going to do a plank to a toe tap. This way. Alternating side. And we're going to do those four exercises three times through. 20 seconds on, 10 seconds to get to the next position. All right, on our feet, here we go, cross jack. Overhead press. Here we are. Cross jack, overhead press.
One more round. Cross jack, overhead press. Hands are up. Cross jack. Water. And we'll go on to our next round. All right, here we go. So our next exercise is we're going to do a squat pulse to a side tap. So you squat down, pulse for two, Stand up and touch your toe out to the side. One, two, stand up and tap. One, two, stand up and tap. So alternating low uh, toe taps. All right, then we're gonna stand with one leg back, one leg forward. The front leg is a little bit bent, hands are up, and we're gonna bring the knee up to our elbows. Hands stay here, arms stay here. The knee comes up to meet it. And then we'll switch into the other side. So 20 seconds each side. And then we're gonna do a squat down, wide, narrow, curtsy squat. Wide, narrow, curtsy squat. Alternating sides. And the last one is a mountain climber. We're gonna do it a little different. We're gonna go one, two, three, donkey kick. One, two, three. And then three mountain climbers, three donkey kicks on the other side. All right. So there's four exercises here. The uh, repeater knee we have to do on both sides. So it's actually five exercises, three rounds. We start with that uh, two pulses after we squat down, lateral tap. Here we go. Squat, two pulses, lateral tap. Two pulses, lateral tap. Make sure you alternate sides and stand all the way up with that lateral tap. The leg that you're standing on is carrying all of your weight. The tap on the side, that leg is not weighted. Ah, rest. Dang it. Hold on, I'm sorry. I reset this and it went to 30 seconds. In three minutes, not. <laughs> sorry. There we go. All right, we're gonna move on to our next exercise, which is the left knee back repeater. 
So left leg back, right leg forward. And then up, knee. So that left knee is coming up high. We're going quick. You should feel your stomach here and a little bit of cardio. That heart rate's getting up. Almost. Beautiful. All right, we're going to switch sides. The right leg is back now. Hands are still up. Front knee is bent. Don't let your elbows go down to meet your knee. Bring your knees up to meet your elbows. together. Sink down. Here we go. Wide, narrow, curtsy. Wide, narrow, other side. Curtsy. Try not to stand up high during the wide, narrow exchange. Alright, hands and toes for our plank. Three mountain climbers, three donkeys. Here we go. One, two, three. Three donkey kicks. Switch sides. One, two, three. Lateral taps. Here we go. Squat down. Two pulse and tap. Nice work. All right. Left leg back, right leg forward. Arms are up. 90 degree angle here. Hinge at the hips just a little. Now let me out your elbows. Back, elbow 
Nice work, everybody. Have a sip of water. We're going to get our mats and go down to the floor. Three core exercises. Our three core exercises are crab toe touches. So we're going to go up onto our hands and feet, opposite sides, reaching and touching. If that's too hard to do both at the same time, just kick one leg out and then the other leg out. Lift one arm, and then the other arm. Okay, then we're going to sit on our butt. Option one is to sit and hold here, tight stomach. Option two is to let go of your arms. Option three is to do X and O. X and O. All right. Our next exercise is called the dead or dying bug. You lay flat on your back. Your arms are up in the air. Your feet are up in the air. Opposite arm and leg reach away from each other and then bring them back in and switch. Okay, as you're going, sometimes we reach and this arm goes down, that's totally fine if that's easier for you. If that hurts your back, arms down on the floor, tap one heel and then the other. All right, for the next exercises. There's three of them. We're going to do them three times each. 20 seconds. Here we go. Let's start with that crab toe touch. So hips up in the air. Opposite touch. Just balancing here. Here we are. Dying or dead bug, lie flat on your back, 
Knees up. Here it comes. Opposite arm leg. Reach away. Bring them back in. Your low back should not change positions as you go. There should be light pressure on the floor. And your low back. The lower you reach your leg, the harder it is. Excellent. All right, round two. Hips up. Front up, toe touches. Here we go. A stretch. Nice work. All right. So go ahead and lie on your back. We're going to bring our right leg up in the air and our left leg, left leg out straight. Gently pull that right leg towards your trunk and draw a big circle with your toe. And go the opposite direction. Good. Pause. Straighten out that leg as much as you can and point and flex your toe. Excellent. Relax that leg and hug it into your chest. And pull that right knee towards the left shoulder. Excellent. 
Fantastic. Go ahead and lie on your left side so your right leg is up on top. And you're going to give yourself a quad stretch by grabbing that right toe. Try to keep your knees close to each other. Good. Bring both knees up high so they're in line right in front of your hips. Arms out in front. We're going to slide that top arm forward and then slide it back. Open all the way up. Eyeballs fall on your right hand. And then bring it back together. I'm going to do that two more times. Slide forward. Slide back and roll it open. Bring it all back together. One more. Slide forward. Slide back. Open up. Bring it all back together. Excellent. Go ahead and lie on your back again. Left leg straight in the air. Pull it towards your trunk. Right leg's out straight and draw some circles with that left toe, big toe. Other direction. Pause. Straighten that left leg out and pump the foot. Point it, flex it. Point it, flex it. Good work. Hug that knee to your chest. Pull that left knee towards your right shoulder. And roll all the way over onto your right side so your left leg is on top. Give yourself a left sided quad stretch by grabbing onto your shoe or foot. Keep your knees close to each other. And if you're not feeling much stretch, squeeze your buns. Excellent. Let go of that foot. Bring both knees up high. Both arms out in front. Slide the left hand forward. Slide the left hand back. You take your eyeballs and follow the left arm as you open all the way up. And then bring it all back together. Two more of those. Slide forward. Slide back. Open up. And bring it back together. One more. Sunrise. Slide forward. Slide back. And open up. Bring it all back. Use your hands to push you on up to sitting. Oh, nice work today. We have finished the workout. Let's see.